we begin with modeling the excavator's boom mechanics. We are using the multi-body library of MapleSim from MapleSoft and intend to export the mechanical model as a functional mockup unit for later use in the VEL. First, we set a fixed frame as a reference point. Then insert a rigid body frame to shift the coordinate system according to the design data. At the new position, we create a revolute. We repeat the whole thing and create a total of three revolute joints, two for the cylinder installation and one revolute around which the boom can rotate. Then we install the cylinder and parameterize it as well. We define installation length and stroke. As a test, we want to move the cylinder and add a ramp function and a block for unit conversion to the model. Then we calculate the model and have to wait until all equations have been solved. All of this is non-real time. We can visualize the result and see how the boom cylinder extends and lifts the boom. Observe the inclined black line. We can pimp up the visualization and insert a CAD graphic of the boom. This looks much nicer. Then we create a subsystem. Define the inputs and outputs, force as an input value, displacement and speed as a cylinder output value. Simulate again and additionally show the results in 2D plots. The subsystem is finally exported as a functional mockup unit, as co simulation with Solver, and is now ready for further use.